Well, a very good evening to you wherever you are. I do hope that you can join me Hello, in appreciating this truly beautiful Stadio evening. Olympico. A night that is absolutely ideal for a game of football. The scenes here really are something, a beautiful picture under the floodlights. Traffic and transport round here, not the kindest, but regardless of that, the fans have found a way of getting here. There is a sense of theatre and the decibel levels are rising. This stadium has that feel of a genuine Colosseum. It could only be Rome. We have already started here. Well, that had the makings of something quite promising, but it's fizzled out into nothing. Might be taken. And the shot! Oh, no, it's an own goal! Well, that wasn't in the script, and you have to feel for him, Peter. It's ended in uh, some embarrassment. Morocco got some help from Lady Luck there, they all count. Well, you can't ask for much better than that, Peter. Bang, bang, two in double quick time. It's one! It's it! A quite incredible spell. They are flying. Morocco clearly executed that with considerable confidence. It only took seconds to score once the ball was recovered. The goal score for Morocco after 14 minutes is number 17, Sofiane Bufal! Morocco grab a couple of goals without reply. It's 2-0. Well, that's... Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. Well, the referee has made it pretty clear now that this is his last chance. Well, I think the referee would have told him to rein it in or, or suffer the consequences. No, oh, he's had it nicked away from him. through here oh they can break here Mattel gets across to intercept that shifted upfield nice interception his positioning was spot on over to the left Buffal goes pelting down that left hand goes in for the header so what can they make of this He's shifting through the gears here. Arankis. It's all a little bit desperate, but it's got the job done. Oh, it's Buffal. Cross goes in there. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. That's a corner. Yes, it is. Gets his head to it. Well, he should have done better, and he knows it. Uh, not enough accuracy on that pass. Two added minutes has been indicated. And the counter is on. He's got away. Hoisted upfield by the keeper. And the half-time whistle goes. Well, Peter, I think the score is a fair reflection of what we've witnessed so far. And 
that Everyone, being please, good movement in, in both midfield and indeed up front, if those players, I think, can carry on where they left off after the break, they should impose themselves even more and probably only one result coming here. Morocco sitting pretty here at half-time, 2-0 up. So we're already into the second period. Sanchez looking to run onto it. It's an inviting looking ball that. Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. It looked as though that might lead to something quite promising, but it turned out that that was not the case. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Tulgar with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. Wriggles his way through. And it's Vargas. And there's his chance to lead the counter. In the city. He's found a way through. Great leap! Now, who's going to be first to this? Nice defending. Physical and effective. That's it! It's run loose. Who's going to get there? The attendance He's had a fair tumble under that challenge. Massive leap! And that's caused a worry or two. A more than decent attempt, Peter. Well, that tackle was certainly sturdy. Oh, that's a key interception. Defenders on the back foot. Oh, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. And no surprise, that's a booking. I just think it was a, a cheap foul to give away. Played out to the right. That's positional gold. The utilisation of space. That pass needed to be... Now the finish! And it's there! And the lead is three! It is surely done! With time and space aplenty, he was never going to miss. It's a simple game, the striker's job is to find the space as often as possible, and he did exactly that. After 75 minutes is... Number two... Morocco take a three-goal lead, and they are romping out of sight. Whatever happens, that's the kind of movement which raises hope. Oh, how that cross missed everyone is an absolute mystery to me. It warranted a finishing touch. Fans delirious. This is utopian. 
What a super header, dispatched beautifully. Well, look, it's, it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle, but that was beautifully met, it really was. Morocco totally rampant here. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them and they're starting to look unstoppable. But there could be more on the way. Four added minutes has been indicated. Oh, that's well spotted. Buffal. Vidal. And that will be the final act. Morocco were irresistible here, dominant, utterly ruthless, only ever one result, a comfortable win. And this Nesiri taking in the accolades, having been named man of the match, and deservedly so. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? I enjoyed that, Peter. Both teams went about their work in a, a really committed manner, and for me it just always held an interest.